Good evening. It's usually the aftermath of a school shooting that we focus on. Tonight, though, we have details of a mass shooting that was prevented at Berkeley High. Yeah, police say they arrested a teenager who was recruiting other students to join that assault. NBC Bears' Terry McSweeney is at Berkeley High with that chilling details. Yeah, the 16 year old allegedly was going to bring assault weapons and he was going to be bringing possibly dis, uh, explosive devices onto campus here. But this is, as you mentioned, one that's not going to happen because someone did what we are all asked to do. And that is if you see something, say something. A Berkeley High School student is in custody tonight, charged with having the materials and a plan to injure or kill people on campus. There was a young person in possession of potentially dangerous materials. Hearing about a threat to our high school is concerning. According to Berkeley police, the 16-year-old suspect went online two weeks ago to advertise his idea, but this time someone called the cops. Police say after receiving a tip that the teenager had been recruiting other high school students to participate in a school shooting at Berkeley High School that included explosives, officers with a search warrant went to the student's home and they discovered parts to explosives, assault rifles, several knives, and electronic items that could be used to create additional weapons. The teenage suspect's name is not being released, and neither is the name of the person who told police of the plot. What's positive in this particular instance is that somebody, an individual in our community, came forward very early uh, to report what they knew to police, that police took immediate action. But in their statement, police say nothing about why the police were tipped off on May 21st, but the teen was not arrested until May 30th, nine days later, and was allowed to turn himself in. That question came up at tonight's school board meeting. Um, during this time, uh, we were uh, actively apprised on a daily basis of both the whereabouts of this particular individual, um, and then we were also leaning on the expertise of uh, Berkeley police experts. Outside Berkeley High this evening, Derek Dupatti picked up his 16-year-old son, Elijah, a junior at the school. It's kind of crazy that we can't really go to school without the fear of it getting shot up or us not possibly making it back home, you know. It's kind of crazy, but it's the world that we live in. I think, you know, we all need to play a closer eye and look into our kids' social media and maybe even the districts need to just hire somebody just to watch social media just to see what's going on. That 16-year-old behind bars tonight, so many questions remain. Uh, we don't have his name, so the who, uh, how he was going to pull this off, and, of course, the why. Live in Berkeley, Terry McSweeney, NBC Bay Area News.